First, watch as Irving demonstrates how to properly assemble the trombone. Then we will assemble it together. First, he unlatches the slide section. Then he will check to be sure that the slide is locked. Next, he picks up the slide, holding it by both braces in his right hand. Next, with his left hand, he will remove the bell section of the trombone, holding it by the large tubing near the brace closest to the bell. He then rotates the bell section so that the slide receiver on the bell section is lined up with the bell section receiver on the slide. As he moves the bell section toward the slide, he is going to tilt the tuning slide toward the slide and lean the slide toward the bell. This will keep the bell from denting the tuning slide, which is a common problem. Next, he is going to connect the bell and the slide at the receivers. The bell section should be at a right angle to the slide section. After Irving makes that adjustment, he will screw the bell section to the slide section, still holding the slide by both braces. After the trombone is together, he will take the trombone out of the case and set the bumper on the floor. Finally, he will take his mouthpiece out and place it in the mouthpiece receiver, giving it a one-quarter turn. Next, he is going to close and latch the case. Now, let's assemble the trombone together. First, kneel down in front of your open case. Check to be sure the slide is locked. Now, pick up the slide, holding it by both braces in your right hand. Next, with your left hand, remove the bell section of the trombone, holding it by the large tubing near the brace closest to the bell. Tilt the top of the bell section toward the slide section and lean the slide toward the bell. Again, this will keep the bell from denting the tuning slide. Next, connect the bell and the slide at the receivers. Adjust the bell section to be at a right angle to the slide section. After that adjustment, screw the bell section to the slide section, still holding the slide by both braces. After the trombone is together, take the trombone out of the case and set the bumper on the floor. Finally, take your mouthpiece out and place it in the mouthpiece receiver, giving it a one-quarter turn. Now, holding the slide by both braces, close and latch your case and carefully take a seat on the edge of your chair. Remember, always hold the slide section by both braces to avoid having the outer slide fall off. Also, you should never lean your trombone against a wall or chair, as it could easily be knocked over and damaged. As you do this more often, you will get faster at it, but always put your instrument together carefully. Each time you put your instrument together, remember these essential elements of trombone assembly. Be careful not to dent your slide with the bell. Attach the two sections at a right angle. Only give your mouthpiece one quarter turn when placing into the receiver. To avoid getting your mouthpiece stuck, never hit your mouthpiece with your hand or against solid objects. When laying your instrument down, lay it on its side. Never lean the trombone against a wall or chair. Learning to care for and properly assemble your instrument is an important first step in playing the trombone.